speaking of weight and, uh, and videos, a friend of mine saw Denzel Washington's latest movie. She said he had to actually gain 40 pounds on purpose for the role. 40 pounds. She goes, I don't know if I would gain weight on purpose, even for a million dollars, would you? I'm like, well, I'm doing it for free now. <laughs> older I get, the more weight I gain. My goal now, I just want to get back to the shape I was in when I thought I was out of shape. <laughs> If I could gain weight and make a million dollars, I would become a cash cow. <laughs> so you get all these benefits, whether you're laughing out loud, whether you're silently laughing, that's for you accounting people sometimes. <laughs> whether you're anticipating, or if you're just making yourself laugh, you still get the benefits if you're just sitting there making yourself laugh. This is the latest thing. Have you heard of it? Laughter yoga. <laughs> Laughter yoga. Huh? I'm not, have you heard of it? It started in India, went to New York, maybe it skipped Texas, went on to LA. <laughs> Shocker. <laughs> People sitting around a circle laughing about nothing, huh? Yeah, I tried, uh, I tried regular yoga once. I can't do that because I got a birth defect. I was born with a spine. <laughs> I do all these uh, events at nice resorts. They always have like a spa. You know, I like a massage every once in a while, but have you ever checked out the food items on a menu at a spa? They are making stuff up with food items, aren't they? There is no research that a lemon sugar body polish is going to make you healthy, is there? We'll do it though. We'll tell our friends, oh yeah, I just got the paraffin wrap for an extra buck. They stuck a wick in me. <laughs> I'm a candle, right? One spa had a milk bath, a seaweed wrap, a raspberry relaxer, a vanilla bean dip conditioner. <laughs> like, I don't have time for all that stuff, man. I just went to Denny's and rolled around the buffet. <laughs> I tried the milk bath, found out I was lactose intolerant. <laughs> One spot had a couple's fertility massage. I'm like, don't go to that by mistake. <laughs> fertility, we wanted exfoliation. <laughs> so, and we tried it, we got the Fitbit. You jo uh, Norma joked about it. she got her 10, 20, 30,000 steps on the Fitbit this, last night. Yeah, I got one of those. Ooh, 10,000 steps, a little badge pops out, right? Yeah, I do 10,000 steps, I want a chocolate chip cookie to pop out. <laughs> I found I had to get the steps in too. As I get older, I wear it at night to and from the bathroom. <laughs> I got tired of wearing it, so I put it on my cat. <laughs> Fitbit called to see if I was still alive. <laughs> we got all those diet things and all that stuff. I, uh, that's expensive. I went on the uh, Jenny Craig diet program by accident. I was staying with a friend of mine who was on it. That's like all the food she had, those little packets. Yeah, I made myself a snack, wiped out five weeks worth of her meals. <laughs> We should not name diet programs after real people, should we, huh? If the person dies, the program goes away, right? Y'all remember the Atkins diet? Yeah, Robert Atkins, he's dead. You know who's still alive? Ronald McDonald. <laughs> he looks good too, eating burgers and fries every day. I, you know, I don't know, we're trying all sorts of stuff. I, uh, I, tried, uh, I, I went to a nutritionist, she said, you gotta eat different colored fruits and vegetables, eat the rainbow. Yeah, so I had a bag of Skittles. <laughs> I lost a pound, right? I, and you know, we're biking, we're doing all, everything. We're biking to work. You guys biking to work here? Nah. Ah, nah, nah. When I was a kid, you saw a guy in a suit on a bike going to work. Your first thought was DUI. <laughs> <laughs> I went to, uh, about two years ago, I did my bucket list trip to Africa, which was a lot of fun, but it was 15 hours one way in coach. 15 out, and in the seat pocket in front of us, they had this little list of exercises you could do in your seat. <laughs> I'm like, the person who wrote this stuff has never flown 15 hours in coach, right? The first exercise is bring your knees to your chest. <laughs> and I'm like, how do you think I got into the seat? <laughs> trying to get my knees out of my chest. <laughs> 